I'm Andrew Warren out of BreakClays.com. This time I've got the trap and the turntable you might have seen before. An Auto Tech six stack electric trap sitting on a turntable with a radio release. I've just stripped and rebuilt this. It's rather a nice trap, that's well designed, very similar to some others that are on the market now at the moment. And underneath there's a turntable, a random turntable with an adjustment. You can see the adjustment on there. If you slide the bolt down that slot, that will give you between 35 and 90 degrees arc. Now there's a radio release with it. That's there, that's an American long range release. And the white box is a distribution box for the power. So the power from the battery comes down the long cable there with the two plugs. You can't have this battery but if you come and collect the trap I expect I can find you one to go with it. Once the power goes into the box you've got the trigger for the trap on the right hand side. You've got power coming out of the middle one for the turntable and power coming out of the left hand side which goes to the trap. Okay, there's your Target Tech sticker. That's local to me. Uh, I've used the turntable before, a few years ago. That's a lovely piece of kit for a follow-on pair or down-the-line targets. Right, we've got a few clays in there. It is safe. So what we'll do for a start, I'll connect the battery. Put one on there. I can do it left-handed. There we go. And my habit is just to tap that, make sure nothing moves, nothing's turned on. So connect that. You've got an on off fire button. On and the trap arms itself. Off, nothing happens, but the trap is still armed. And if we push fire, there goes your first clay. Okay, so that's easy enough. It's now stopped in the safe position again. So we'll turn it on and arm the trap. There we go. That's all armed and ready. Now we can go to the radio release, which has three buttons. Top is T and F, which is turn and fire. The F on the left at the bottom is for fire, and the T is to T for, to turn the trap. So if we turn the trap, here we go, I'll show you that. Push to turn, turntable has got a limited movement. And then that goes again, and again, and that lost light between left and right to whatever arc you've set it out on the slot at the bottom. And then we've got the fire button which is just the trap. The trap the fire and fire again. Then we can turn the trap if we want to give it a different angle. And if we do the T and F it fires and turns. And again, turn and fire. And after another two or three, that should start going back to the left. Here we go. She's gone back to the left. You'll get more movement than that each time. But I've got it all set up here, so I'll show you the array of clays that it's actually throwing in a minute. And if we go around the side, we'll show you. There's the motor, there's the belt system which holds the clay stack in place while it's going over the hole and dropping one. It drops that one onto a soft full plate which is a lovely soft version on this trap, that's lovely. You've got a black spring, well it is now, so if we fire that again, there we go, a lovely little system this is, it's a nice trap. Very similar to the ones I use for my own shoots. 
and we go to the top, we'll fire the trap again, and that holds against the belt, doesn't necessarily move the belt, but the tension is there to hold the stack up. There we go. So that's about it, I think that's all I can tell you. Let's just do the turn and fire and turn and fire. I've now put out somewhere around 40 clays after rebuilding it. I haven't had one broken one. It sounds soft when it drops onto the plates. There's no clank and the knocking. I know where the trap came from. I know it's had an easy life. So there you are. They'll both be for sale on my website, either singly as a trap, as a turntable, and as a radio. I'll rewire everything for you if you just want a part of it. Or if you want the whole lot, that will also be available on the website. So I'll just disarm it, and I'll show you where the clays have been going to. So to disarm, we just do fire and it's in the off position so we're going to go in front of the trap so we disconnect the battery anyway just to be sure right this is just a temporary setup for the turning on the turntable so this is where all the clays have been gone to nice little spread over a very short distance just to give you some idea of what it's doing okay so i'm andrew warren howtobreakclays.com the website is www.howtobreakclays.com, all one word. And with a bit of luck, I shall see one of you in the future, and you will end up with a lovely little trap. Thanks for watching.